This is not what you want to see from your star goalie. So the New York Rangers lost the New Jersey Devils 5-3 last night, and it was not a pretty game for Igor Shosturkin. All four goals scored on Shosturkin were pretty weak, and a combination of sloppy team defense and missed routine saves were just backbreakers that allowed the Devils to climb back into the game after being down by two. When you're a team like the New York Rangers who rely on superstar goaltending, these types of goals are very concerning. What's even more concerning though were Shosturkin's comments after the game. Shosturkin was his own worst critic as he didn't hold back about his game and admitted he felt ashamed at his performance. And while he did admit that every goal was an easy play that needed to be stopped, coach Gerard Gallant disagreed with the star goalie shouldering the blame. Gerard stressed the fact that this is a team game and that the whole group, starting with the coaches, need to turn it around. While I believe it's important for you to be honest about your game, you never want to see your star goalie talk this negatively about his play. The mental side of the game is everything for goaltenders and if you aren't confident in your ability, things can go south pretty quick. I do admire Gerard Gallant stepping up and taking accountability as a whole too. We've seen coaches kick a player when they're down to try and challenge that player, but with today's stars, that is hardly the correct route. Shosturkin entered the game with solid numbers at 10-3-3 with a 9-14 save percentage. He's probably taking a bit too much responsibility for what has been some brutal team defense. Although those were saveable pucks for Shosturkin, the Rangers defense looked lost throughout this entire game. Personally, I'm not worried about Shosturkin. He's a Vesna caliber goalie who will have to learn how to deal with these ups and downs. Ideally, you want him to remain calm and confident when things aren't going well. Sometimes you just have a bad game and you could use a little bit of fire to turn things around. I am concerned about the rest of the Rangers team defensively. Having lost 8 out of their last 12 games, the concern is growing for a team who now finds themselves on the outside looking in. So let me know if you think the Rangers are just going through a slump right now or if you think they have truly regressed from last season. Before we end the video, November 29th is Giving Tuesday and Hockey Helps the Homeless Drop the Mitts is a perfect way to give give back to the community. Every pair of mitts purchased will provide a full day's worth of meals to someone in need. So if you want to help fight homelessness in Canada, I'll leave those links for you to check out down below. That's it for me today. So if you enjoyed the video, make sure you like and subscribe for more hockey content.